Now give me the first letter. C. Cal! No. Clay? No. Clay off? Hey, it's Court Howell here, producer of Mayberry Man, with another behind the scenes update. And 2020 is winding down an unforgettable year for many reasons, but one of the good reasons is that we went out and we made an amazing movie about The Andy Griffith Show. That's right, it wasn't easy, but we did it. We are currently in post-production and we are headed toward the finish line. Now, we actually have a rough cut of the movie put together that we uh, began showing to some focus groups, and I wanna share some of the feedback we've gotten. We're really excited. Here are just a few of the comments we've received. It is a feel-good movie that the whole family can watch. If you like The Andy Griffith Show, then you will love this film. It's a wonderful tribute to the show and a great message. Family-friendly, entertaining, heartwarming. A great family movie. And more than 80% of the people who screened the movie said they would recommend it to a friend. So we're excited by the response to our initial rough cut, and it'll only get better as we add music, sound effects, and all the other finishing touches. We will continue to refine the edit of the movie, and while we're doing that, we've also started working on a movie trailer. Now, this is just a rough first pass. It's a work in progress, but I wanted to share it with you so you can really see what Mayberry Man is all about. Take a look. Chris Stone is a Hollywood movie star living life in the fast lane. I know who you are. You're Chris Stone! Can I have your autograph? <laughs> all that's about to change. All rise. What are you in for? You were observed driving 105 miles per hour in a 45 mile per hour zone. The fine, please? Uh, there'll be no fine. Excuse me? Mr. Stone, I'm sentencing you to Mayberry Fest. Golly! Welcome to Mayberry Fest! Have you ever heard of Mayberry Fest? Dad used to go to it every year till he got too old. Mayberry Fest. It's a wonderful week of all things Mayberry. You know what's gonna happen to me when I show up there? I'm gonna get mobbed. Mr. Chris Stone. <laughs> the son of Walter Stone from season three. <laughs> oh, you're Chris Stone, Walter's son. That's Walter Stone's kid. How are you? We are glad to have you, Nick. Chris, who's Kate? Kate? Oh, she runs this whole event. Been running it for years. Hey, she's a doll. Hi. <laughs> You know, this is one of Dad's most memorable roles. Mayberry Fest made him a big star. Look, I don't care about Mayberry Fest. I certainly don't care about Dad or his career. How can you say that? You were forced to come here? You're a bigger phony than I thought you were. Mayberry isn't just a place. It, it's a state of mind. It's anywhere where folks treat one another with the dignity given them by their creator. Things get a little crazy around here during Mayberry Fest. Fried chicken! Wait, I'm gonna see those hands. Get them up! Nobody gets a drop of no barn when I got this bad boy by my side. I'm a tenor in the Mayberry Barbershop Quartet. <laughs> Shazam! Who are you calling a prankster? <laughs> Judy, Judy, Judy. Why the hell you do that? Take a trip back to Mayberry. Cheese. With the fans and discover what you've been missing. Real nice to meet you there, Chris Stone. And remember, no jaywalking. Well, clearly it's not finished yet, but I thought you would appreciate a sneak peek. Now, a frequent question we get is, when will the movie be released? Well, that is tough to say. We certainly plan to do our private red carpet screenings in 2021, but as far as any kind of public release, whether it's in a theater or streaming on Netflix or something like that, that will be determined by a distributor. And since we don't have a distributor just yet, there's no way to predict when or how the movie will be released to the general public. So right now, the only way to see this movie is to be a backer. And it's not too late to become a backer at supportmayberryman.com. And if you're not a backer yet, you do need to act fast because the deadline to get your name in the closing credits with a special thank you is New Year's Day because we need to finalize our closing credits in early January. That's part of the post-production process. The 
good news is we've opened back up our $25 Charlene level to make it easy for anyone to be a part of this. At the Charlene level, you get your name in the credits, you get an invitation to our pre-release online screening, plus you get a digital download of the movie so you can watch it whenever you want. We also have levels that include other rewards like a DVD, baseball cap, t-shirts, autographed script, and even that red carpet screening I mentioned. Now, for you super fans, we also have a limited number of producer level opportunities still available. If you'd like to see your name in the opening credits, we would love to have you step up and be one of our producer level backers. Maybe you already back the movie at another level, so all you do is pay the difference to become an associate producer, co-producer, or even executive producer, and your name will appear in the opening title sequence. Just contact me at court at mayberryman.com if you you'd like to learn more about becoming one of our producers. And there are plenty of other perks that go along with being a producer, including being listed as a producer on imdb.com, which is pretty cool. Finally, I'd like to say thank you to all the folks who helped make Mayberry Man possible. When most people look back at the year 2020, they're going to think it was a terrible year. And of course, many people were personally affected by the pandemic and the resulting shutdown that cost people their jobs and their income. But anyone who was involved in Mayberry Man, whether you contributed money or you traveled on your own dime to be in the movie or you let us film in your home or business or you worked tirelessly behind the scenes, which many, many people did, we came together in the true spirit of Mayberry to do something special, to create something truly good at a time that was filled with so much negativity. And this movie, Mayberry Man, is it the Andy Griffith show? Of course it's not. But it's a wonderful story with a positive message that will live on as part of Mayberry history for future generations. And that's something we can all be proud of. So again, thank you so much for your continued support of Mayberry Man. Uh, it's a labor of love for us, and even though we have a few months to go, the finish line is in sight. And I promise you, when you see the movie, you are going to be thrilled. So that does it for this edition of Mayberry Man Behind the Scenes. That does it for 2020. So until next time, thanks for watching.